Why aren't people watching my YouTube videos? Hey there fellow YouTubers, Mark here. And today what we're gonna talk about are three simple, tiny little reasons that people overlook when they're trying to figure out why people don't watch their videos, okay? Now the first thing you gotta realize, one of the first things that turns people onto your video is your thumbnail. If your thumbnail is lame, okay, if it's just like some blank picture or if it's just some like snippet out of your video that doesn't make any sense, that's gonna turn people off. You want to make your own thumbnails. And if you're not sure what a thumbnail is, the thumbnail is the picture that shows up when your video is suggested or when people search, it's that video, that picture that comes up. And the thing is, depending on what your video is, well, it doesn't matter the topic, the thumbnail is always gonna be important, but that thumbnail can really sell your video because you're talking about something exciting showing that excitement in the picture can really show something like if you're showing like the awesomeness of six flags that you probably want to show a person like on the roller coaster ah looking excited and having fun or if it's something something whimsical oh the 10 best star wars jedi you might want to have somebody with a lightsaber on there showing their face and stuff like that you want a thumbnail that inspires people to click if your thumbnails aren't inspirational people aren't going to click on it i mean i mean i hate to say this but in youtube you know that they say don't judge a book by its cover well people judge a video by its thumbnail okay so you got to make sure you have a good thumbnail there and there's a lot of different platforms you can use yes you can get Photoshop and make them but I recommend going to Canva Canva is a free service I'm not getting any money for this don't worry uh, Canva is a free service where you can make thumbnails and do like graphics and stuff like that to make it look cool and you want to do that because a good thumbnail that will get people to watch a bad thumbnail that's the first thing it's not gonna get people to watch your video okay second thing second little thing you might not think about is the title of your video if the title of your video is lame people aren't gonna watch it okay hey I like cheese mmm no you gotta explain like oh the best cheese is in cheddar or something like that you want to have a title that inspires people to watch okay and usually that means have a title that relates to what the contents about so if you're gonna be doing a travel video on Germany you want to make sure you're talking about you know Germany is in the title travel in Germany tips for Germany my experience living in Germany something with Germany in there because that's gonna help people know what it's about if it's more like you won't believe what I did today well those days of YouTube are gone you need to make sure that the title really relates with the content is so it lets people know what they're gonna watch also a bad title hurts your search engine optimization SEO if you're not sure what that is that is the system the algorithm kind of stuff that computers use that YouTube uses to make it easier for people to find videos so if I'm searching videos on Italy and I'm typing Italy in it's gonna search for videos that say Italy in the title so you want to make sure that your title relates to that because it makes it easier for YouTube to kind of push it to people that are looking for content about the topic you're talking about, okay? So if your title's bad, people won't be inspired to watch it. If your title's irrelevant, then YouTube won't know what to think about it and that, that can hurt you, okay? And then the third thing, and the one that I know a lot of YouTube, you know, people online never talk about is sometimes you just don't have good content. Okay, I'm not gonna lie to you. I mean, I don't always make good content. I try, but sometimes some of the stuff is not that great. But you know what? I work on it. I try to make it better. And that's one thing you have to realize is your first few YouTube videos, they're not gonna be great. You learn and you learn and you learn. I know from my other channel, I didn't even know how to edit a video. So it'd be like one, I'd put the camera up, go film the whole thing. Hopefully I didn't mess up kind of stuff. Those videos aren't really any good. Now I know I can edit. I can cut things out. I can put things in. I can use B-roll you know that's the background video like when people are talking and the pictures come over the top and the video comes over the top you can use those things and that's gonna make it a better quality video so instead of making bad content or, or irrelevant content or just worthless content make something worthwhile and if you want to know how to make some good content, you want to know what some good stuff you can do to really help out, we have a video on the well, first thing you should do as a YouTuber before you make any videos so you can make the best content possible. So I hope that helps you know three little reasons, three simple reasons why people aren't watching your content. I mean, I'm, I'm serious. If you fix, you do some good thumbnails, you do some good titles and you make good content, the views will come. It does take time though. I'm not gonna lie to you. It doesn't happen overnight. You don't get a million subs in one day, okay? You don't get a thousand subs in one day. I mean, eventually if you're a big channel, yes, of course. But when you're starting out, it takes time, okay? So I hope this helps you. If you wanna know more YouTube tips, click that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and we put out new business videos, new YouTube videos pretty much every week. So I hope it helps you out. Anyway, I'll say bye and good luck YouTubing. Bye.